Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jenny and today um, we're going to be starting with a little bit of a speed run because I realized that I have some homework left over from last time and I would want to do a lot of things this episode. So what you're seeing now is four times the speed. Um, I wanted to do a bit of writing for all of the stuff that we did and put in some neighborhood decorations. Some really simple ones. These will probably be redone together. Um, but for now, I just like there to be something, a little bit of anything, um, to fill in the gaps and make the place look less bare. And I figured, oh, sh no, this will be a problem many, many times. I'll, I'm going to be putting those the wrong way. I'd see immediately and I don't notice. Oh, no. Anyway, um, I wanted to do this separately because I felt like I'm self-conscious about my writing as is, you know? And then trying to commentate over I, my writing is a, it's not a good solution. Oh, good. I, I did see it. I got a little bit a little bit salty. Ah, oh, no, I'm doing it again, aren't I? No? Ah, no! But yeah, I decided to do it this way because I felt like... I'm really self-conscious about my writing, like I said, and if I'm not having a good time, then you're not having a good time either. Um, also, I had some extra time because uh, stuff was happening in the house and I had time to play but I didn't have you know the audio space to commentate if that makes sense this way I can do both um, so I'm just putting in some detailing around the, the farm right now to just kind of signify that that's where everything is starting from then I'm looking at the different kinds of lots I have these little small lots that I'd like to use, um, and <laughs> beautifully named farm shop. Um, again, these names will be changed. I just um, want to be able to just plop stuff in for now. I'm trying to change the uh, type of the plots, but I can't do that from here. I'll need to do that with the cheats. Other than that, I wanted to get started on this next thing, actually later in this episode, which is going to be the Marine Research Center. Um, it is the most important and only, so far, <laughs> employer in town. Um, and I figured this way I would have an excuse to actually use the some of the careers and some of the items that I never do, but I do have downloaded. We're gonna be doing the, the actual building of the place together. We're about halfway in the speedrun. Um, <laughs> speedrun? Speed build? I guess? Um, but yeah, this is very simple, very simple. I downloaded these parking lots from Mod The Sims and I figured they could be useful, but why would anyone have a car in this island for now? It doesn't really make sense. Uh, this is also another place that we're gonna be building together later on. Um, the Superb Motel, see? Because it's the, the marine... marine... thing? Yes? I know nothing about marine research and marine biology. I just want a place that could signify an actual working location. And we're gonna be doing our best, basically. <laughs> to see what we can do. Um, oh yeah, the the NB tag for all of the of the locations. That's what I use to signify that it's been not built. So I may have placeholder plots for stuff. But also I don't like it when those show up in the list when Sims are trying to go to places. So Ideally, if I could place lots and not have them show up until I'm ready, that would be best, but I don't think that's the way The Sims works. Um, if you do know how to do that, uh, let me know. I'm... It is something that is bothering me. A little bit of cheese. 
just anything, literally anything, again, these will not likely be permanent. We'll be detailing around um, everything. These, however, I think are really cute. Um, little huts. I thought about putting like the other huts, but these are cuter. And horsies. Here I'm still trying to find other things to put in that island, but no. Um, I do feel lighthouses would probably be a thing. Probably not yet, but I'm thinking about the placement. I think this one up here is gonna stay, but the other one not so much. I can never get these things to look good or work. It's just... it's weird. I don't get it. How's your day going, by the way? <laughs> this is totally, totally random, but um, let me know. And that's it. I'm gonna be seeing you back in the normal gameplay. Alright, and welcome back to the game. So as you saw, um, we did a little bit of detailing here. Everything is probably going to still change, but it feels a lot better not having things be as bare. So today I would like to get started on some building stuff. And we have the Marine Research Center to play in. And then also we'll have a... Um, technically this will be an apartment. But we will have a set of um, a kind of like a motel type apartment where you'll have just rooms. Where sims can live until um, until they have their, have their own house, basically. Or something like that. My headcanon is that the Marine Research Center is the one that is employing these people and then they'll live there right so this is what I wrote um, in the speed run the the marine research center is one of Silicon Shore's most important and only sources of employment directly funded by the big wigs all the way in Sim City it's determined to expand the bounds of sim knowledge for all and I know nothing about marine research <laughs> so this will probably also need adjusting later on but until then um, we're just gonna do what we can all right and we are in build mode um, gosh I forget was I able to again I have not been playing Sims for Sims 2 for a while can I smooth these over? I can't. Alright. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna have to live with it. So, my vision for this lot, right, is that we're gonna have some sort of cafeteria around here. And then people can eat outside. Not in real life, but we can imagine. Um, we'll have some offices, we'll have um, some other things that we can think of. Probably a pool for people to practice in or something. I don't know. Um, and this is gonna be my first build and a foundation for a while, so <laughs> bear with me. Um, we're going to want a, an entrance. I think. And then an atrium of some sorts. With probably stairs stairs so it's gonna be pretty pretty hefty I think for now I'm also gonna use this as like the unofficial city hall sort of so it'll have some other functions as well because um, it truly is the only place <laughs> that we're gonna have for a while um, for some reason it only now crosses my mind that I probably should have looked at some images of like marine research labs or anything um, but you know um, uh, I'm not gonna for some reason I don't feel like it so just gonna have to deal with whatever I got I think I do want the building to be balanced a bit 
then there needs to be space for like I don't know toilets or something here hmm maybe this swing has like oh we can't go further can we go further if we use this no okay so that's our maximum space hmm now can we have a pool on foundation no we cannot so we're gonna have to do something like this i think for the pool oh gosh and i am <laughs> i am such a noob at building feel free to give me tips I will need all of them, in fact. Is that the size of the pool we can have? Really? Oh. But you know, this isn't meant for, for recreation. This is not a recreation pool, no. Um, that's fine, that's fine. That's, I'm gonna tell myself that's fine and you're gonna have to deal with it. This is not the tile that's gonna be here forever, but I just... And we're not gonna have anything fun in this pool either. No, no slides, no nothing. This is a very serious pool for serious purposes, for science, you see. Okay. I think this room needs to be up this big, right? That means that if we have a, a hallway, we can have two labs here, maybe, and then a showering room. Then we have can have bathrooms. I know that the game has like gendered bathrooms, but I I don't care. <laughs> so mine are going to be very much ungendered bathrooms i it's annoying in game i find it annoying anyway to have gendered bathrooms it's it's inconvenient to me so so we're not gonna be fucking around with that um and again um if you didn't don't remember um from the previous game uh, previous time this is not um a child-friendly let's play um I, I, I'm sorry, but I'm not. I'm not gonna be not swearing um, because this is this is my my fun, you know. And you are invited, sure. Oh, I do like that. That is so fancy. Okay. Means that we can, we have to have an upstairs, okay. I think I want the upstairs to be mostly open. Like this, maybe? And we can have the offices be upstairs. That actually does make sense, yeah. Do I want this to be open? Hmm. To the cafeteria? Hmm. I'm gonna be thinking about that. This I want to be closed though, at least this space for for offices. What size and shape do I want these offices to be? I guess that seems about right for an office space. And these will have like computers in them and a chair and basically nothing else. Well, nothing else of of note anyway. Detailing, of course. Let's see. If that's the shape. I mean it would make sense to make this the same. 
but also I do kind of want it to be asymmetrical a little bit. Hmm. See, what if... What if we had a walkway here? And then this was a patio? Space? But then on this side it was closed. Oh, maybe we could even... Oh... I don't know if I like that. <laughs> I feel like if we do this, it has to be the same, 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 you know? And I do like the idea of the cafeteria being open two stories. That's fine, I can do that. But I do want there to be... I don't want the kitchen to be open, so... We have space for a kitchen and storage, I guess something so this part oh but no see if I was in a location like this I would want the sea view for the cafeteria right that would make more sense so maybe the kitchen has to be like on this side because this is this is the less interesting view for sure so these are something to be determined. <laughs> and this part is going to be closed. And then a railing. That is very open. Um, all the sound from here will go over to here and vice versa. That's not ideal. Hmm. So there would need to be like a wall here, I think. Just for noise noise purposes, you know? Not that it matters in game, but it matters to me in my heart. So maybe this needs to be like this. See, maybe this isn't... Maybe this isn't a bathroom. Maybe this is the kitchen, then. Because then we can have all of this open, right? And this can be storage or a bathroom additional bathroom and then we don't need this either yeah that's a leader gosh if this was the sims 4 I'd, I'd know how to make this a real nice classy like ceiling but I I don't know how to do it in this game oh, actually I did download these from Numenor. So maybe maybe we can have like a oh how does how do these work? Is it like this? But how do I make the corner then? Huh see I kind of want the slope here. So... I'm not sure how to do that. Um, maybe this? Maybe like this? You know what? That's I'm not a master builder, so you know I'll I'll take that probably. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I just like the idea of being like entirely glass. idea what I'll do for the ceiling, by the way. <laughs> I just want them to be able to see. Oh gosh. Maybe the corners were a bad idea, actually, <laughs> now that I think about it. Because I... I want this part to be flat. I 
think you might be... And then... Maybe there'll be stairs there? Like that. Because I wouldn't want to... I want them to get a view, you know? But I also don't want it to be... I want it to be, like, kind of structurally sound-ish looking. Which feels so silly to say. This is The Sims. Like, it doesn't matter. Would that be a good compromise? Then... Maybe these need to be, like, structural beams, like, in the corners. So, so like this, then I can have this still be like this. But maybe, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Because now I can also continue this down. Of course, I'll need to make sure that these are thick on the inside, too. But you know? I do like that. This is way too fancy for this place, though. But... You know, I like it. And if I like it, then that's how it can be, you know? It's all make-believe, anyway. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> ah. Okay. Oh, I do like it. Okay. I feel a bit better. Um, I'm not known for being the best builder. I think this bit needs to be flat. Yeah, but it needs to be flat from like here, right? And then these need to be flat. <laughs> this is weird. <laughs> okay, this part is a bit weird, alright? Um, we might come back to this, to be honest. <sighs> do I want this bit to be flat? Yeah, I do. I do want that part to be flat. Yeah, like this walkway here and I want to keep it but I might want to do it like this instead yeah because then that's again structural integrity very important <laughs> hmm fences oh yeah I again I have no idea why this happens but these are <laughs> These look really cool and they work just fine. It's just the thumbnails are... are fucked. I have these that are like matching, but these are way too tall for, you know, for this. Hmm, I might put these down here actually. Because I was gonna put like a, a window here. But I think this will be fine. Yeah, okay. B back to work. Okay, okay. Here. Hmm. Oh, yeah, and these match the stairs. So maybe I'll put one of these in there. This one? It's not this color, is it? <laughs> it's not this color. <laughs> it's this color, maybe. He just needs to. Yeah. I do like it when things are matchy matchy. It looks good. Looks good to me. Okay. Now. Back to the railings. <laughs> Back to the outside. Oh gosh, I keep getting distracted. Um, but there's so many nice things, like, like these. Ooh, for sure. When we're doing like an actual town hall, we need to consider these. Like seriously, consider those. 
Hmm, I don't know. Maybe I just don't have one that I like for the outside. Like this? It's a bit too casual. Like, um, it's a bit too... Beachy, if that makes sense. I want something more... More industrial. Well, I guess we can always do a half wall. Um, and that should be fine. Maybe these. And I don't like the little like bits at the, at the corners. Just this. I mean, we could definitely make this fit by just using the correct, correct painting then. I'm gonna put stairs to the side. Yeah, we'll do that. Same here. Here. I am a sucker for a patio. I just You have a you have an ocean view. You have to you have to use it. Okay. Not the tough part. The actual roofing? Um hmm. I, can you tell that I'm procrastinating on, on doing it? <laughs> Maybe it's gonna be like this. No, not quite like that. How long can this go, actually? It's not the worst. Could we do it like... Could... Hmm, no, no, no. Would it be fun if I did it like... Uh, like this? But then also like this. Hmm? <laughs> no, in fact, it would not be fun. But which one's better? I think this way is better because then I can put a sign in the front, you know? Also, it makes sense that if it's raining, um, all the water would flow towards the back instead of like on the sign and stuff, right? Yeah. I'll say yeah, but I don't know if I agree, so... <laughs> uh, well, we're gonna just have to... Just have to deal with that. Oh yeah, I forgot I have these. These are like... These are meant to go with these windows. To be honest, I don't quite understand what they do. Oh, they fill those corners. Oh. Are there multiple or am I just stupid? Um. I don't I don't feel like they're doing what they're supposed to be doing. <laughs> Maybe if it's here. Is that filled or no? Nah? No. Nah. Do I need to put it like on the outside? Let's see. No, I don't. Um, hmm. Is it like this? Right? I'm, I'm not sure. Because I can't just put it here either. It doesn't really do the thing.
those gaps are are annoying. Hmm. Are we going to do it halfway? Is that good? <laughs> oh no. Do I need to do this side from the inside? Yes! Okay. So this side from the inside, alright. And this side from the outside. We want it to be that color. Well, um, no, actually, <laughs> we do not. <sighs> That's inconvenient. All right. What other colors do you have? Do you have a basic white? I'm I'm down with basic white. That's good enough to me. You know what? I'll take it. Ideally, I would have wanted either like a grey or one that matches those, but... I'm, I'm uh, not quite at the point yet where I'd be doing like custom recolors for, for my builds. In The Sims 2 anyway. I do that for The Sims 4 because it's... Uh, I don't know, it's like super easy. <laughs> actually <laughs> for the sims 4 um i haven't looked into it for the sims 2 yet maybe one day i will um i did that one like um blush through body shop and that was easy but i haven't done anything for build by stuff yet okay that's nice it's very clean Put that off for a while. Um, sh oh, we've got like sloppy doors. Interesting. Like curved. Hmm. Should we use this in the front? We could just get more glass in. It's fine. But then, does that defeat the purpose of like? This being load bearing, you know? It does a little bit, doesn't it? And then this looks weird. <sighs> and now do we have to reconsider do we have to reconsider putting a glass one instead? Or maybe this one actually. I do like that one. Maybe we'll do it like this. Oh, not quite like that. But you know, like this. I do like it. Not sure if I like this here. But I think this would work for... Well, I don't know. We'll get to it. It's a bit too skinny, in my opinion. Maybe we'll use the the base game one, you know. Now the glasses don't match, do they? Well, this definitely is too tall. These glasses definitely don't match either. Hmm. A weird angle for the light just coming from behind, doesn't it? I just want like a plain white smooth fence that's this tall but a little more airy well I think we need to have these be like this then. 
It's unfortunate. But sometimes um, that's how it is, you know? Do we have any three white arches? I would like an arch, like an actual arch. No. Okay. Guess this will be open. Then I want a different type of window. Could be this. Could also be this. It's gonna be this to be a bit different. Because I want there to be like. I don't want it all to be same, same, you know? And this was the kitchen and bathroom, so those will not have windows, alright? Should we give access to the balcony from the offices? We could, but I think it would look a bit weird, wouldn't it? Just four doors. Yeah, this is an apartment. It's not an apartment. Wait, unless... What if... What if we do this? Add a bit of something, something. We could even do the same here. Well, actually, we can't because the supports. But what we do? What do we do here? Do we just add one of one of these? One of one of these. I think this is still too tall, like, it should only be like half that height, but I can't make it any... I can't make the slope any less, because this is the minimum angle. I could have the roof start from like halfway, but that would also look really weird. Wouldn't it? Hmm. What if? What if I just uh, cheat? <laughs> what if I just cheat? You know? Have you ever thought about that? Just, just, just choosing to cheat? I don't know. What if I do this? It's still gonna look weird here, and that's where all the, all the rainwater would collect, see? No. It was an intriguing idea, but no. Now what if... What if the roof... What if the roof goes... Goes like this? And then... Wait, wait until you see my vision. This is the smallest. Homey. I do like the asymmetry, just kind of kind of like a wave-like vibes. But no, it's too like 
We might use that for the motel, actually. That's a good idea for the motel. Maybe this is the thing that's throwing me off. Because I, the, the middle bit needs to be the highest, right? Hmm. I mean, in real life, these places would have flat roofs, right? Like 99% of the time. So I shouldn't be too harsh on myself for that. But. Okay, and that's the max I can put in there. I just do it like like this so that they're gonna be like diminishing waves you know kind of a bit better but now I still want to have like a place for a sign you know so. what if I just do this oh no what if I do this No, it's too repetitive. You know, maybe just putting in a sign will work. And it'll it's just fine, you know? What if I'm fretting over nothing? It's worth a check, don't you think? I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> I truly don't know how to feel about that. That does feel more institution y, right? Like this part and this part feel correct. This part does not feel correct. Hmm. Maybe I just need to continue this thing. I like the wave idea, but again, it's not a very. Not for this build, you know? Do I need to continue these, like, spines at the back? I like that I'm calling them spines. <laughs> I don't know why. This is not how spines work. This is more like ribs maybe still no place for the sign <laughs> My dear. maybe the sign will be down here you know what i Oop. I'll, i might have to take that and then if i had a thing that's like half this size Boy, that would be great, but I don't, so... Here I'd like all of this to be... To be just, uh... 
slideable window, but... I don't think it can be. That just works. Okay. I'll take it. And then these windows... I want there to be windows, I'm sorry. It's probably not realistic to be... <coughs> to have windows in here, but... Gosh darn, I want them! Because this is like a testing area. Then again, like, this is a private beach, I guess, for the... Whatever company this is. Uh, should I come up with a company name and everything? Probably should, shouldn't I? Sure. <laughs> I'm not very invested in stairs. Uh, in these stairs, anyway. Anything is fine as long as it works. I'm I'm good. <laughs> there is one thing that I want to add still to the outside shape, and that's um. Do I actually have like actual HVAC units in here somewhere? I do not, um, in fact I do not have them, alright, well I'm just gonna make my own, um, there. Beautiful, I'm just gonna put that there instead actually. It looks fucking awful, but they do look fucking awful in real life, you know, realism. <laughs> Oh gosh. That's just how it is sometimes, you know? I don't know what I'm gonna do with the terrain yet. Um, can I actually fit in parking spaces in here? Oh, completely by accident I could. Uh, which means that I'm going to... I'm in fact going to do that. Um, that's a pickle. I'm gonna do it like this, and then... Like that. Because this is gonna go straight. And then there's gonna be like a shoot off over there. Yeah. And then probably there should be a walk path here. Right? Now, ideally, there should be doors from the cafeteria too, so that you can sit over here as well. So I'm gonna put in the patio. Yeah. Um. And then the doors. I'm imagining these are like full... Like one of those doors that you kind of push and to the slide to the side. Sliding doors. That's what I'm thinking. But we don't have those in the in the Sims 2 in this scale. That's a Sims 4 only thing. Oh my gosh, that game. I'm shaking my head. I 
like I love it, but also it oh my god, it is so infuriating in so so many ways. <laughs> this for the no. has to be this one okay I guess that seals what um what fence we'll have to use I do like this other one better but Oh, that feels so wrong. Um, okay, maybe I can make it in like this. Nope. You know what? No. What if? <laughs> what if I do this? Oh, that is so silly. But does it kind of fit though? Um. I'm gonna lie to myself and say yes, and I'm not gonna. I'm gonna not gonna boo boo you if you disagree. I think I'm just gonna nod sagely and be like, mm, mm, everyone can have their opinion, you know. But then I'm gonna secretly agree with you. I think it's one of those things. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's the line of that we shall not cross. <laughs> Here, I put like a different kind of fence again. <laughs> again, a fence we do not have. Hmm. You know what? Maybe on the beach, this one is fine. Just so that no one rolls, you know, down. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. That I'm vibing with. Okay. Now. This, I'm, I need to look at the sign first, I'm sorry. <laughs> I made a collection at one point that had all the signs I had, but I might have downloaded more signs since... Oop, that was a glitch. I'm going to save, just in case. I don't want to redo all of this. It's been... 46 minutes? <laughs> okay, back to business. All right. I put it somewhere, but I haven't really... Like, called the previous ones yet? Mm, did I put them here? No. I did not, in fact, put them there. I don't remember the. Th <sighs> you know, this one? So most of my signs are here, alright. So this for a marine biology center. No. This one. Uh, this is more of a <laughs> werewolf slash vampire bar vibes. But you know, maybe it's to do with like the tides and the moon and stuff. You know, I if I, if I have nothing else, I'll use that one. This one is too grungy. <laughs> Yep, no. One of these might be fine. Check the colors on this one, and then there's the default ones that come with the game. Let's see. I like this one the most, because this one lights up at night. But... No, I don't have any. See, these would probably work, the swimming ones. Okay. 
so these are my options, basically these two. Hmm. This one would go on there. Just have to need to put quarter tile piece on. This one will not, absolutely not. But is it one of those things where we have one here and then And this up there. You know what? I think this might be a time when we use the actual... The in-game... The, 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 the sorority and fraternity signs instead. Wherever those are. Um, they're not here. Oh, shit. I got like a... Um, a mod that repositions stuff and now I can't find anything uh, but this needs to go into the science science category this is a sign but is this there already? probably not a lot of these things are, aren't hmm. this one does not have those it's gotta be somewhere in here right? just all no they're not here the hobbies no A sorority sign or a fraternity sign. Who are you? <laughs> Is it just not available for commercial venues? I can probably find it somewhere in here, right? Under the um, this this place. No. Are they just not allowed anymore? Why? Am I blind? If I am blind, it, it's not here. I uh, There's no way it's here. But there are other things here that I want, actually. I want one of these somewhere. <laughs> uh, would this work better? You know what? Maybe we'll think about the sign later. Maybe maybe that's none of my business. I'll take this one instead. Maybe the signs are just not uh, there, you know? <laughs> maybe. <laughs> I'm, I'm confused. I'm still thinking about the signs. I kind of want to use these for most things here. I don't know why. I think it's the round windows. They give me Kind of like a undersea vibe. <laughs> oh, and that's gonna be... That's so gonna be a, a bathroom. Okay. Just simple doors to the offices. Kitchen can be a walkthrough kitchen. Um, hmm. And some 
arches here, perhaps? More glass arches? No. I like slightly matchy arches here. Sure. And then on this side, it can be white. Yeah. And this is something. <laughs> something. Ugh. We're getting the layout there. So that's good. Uh, I'm, hmm, hmm, hmm. Gonna slap on some floors, maybe? I think most of this should just be kind of depressingly cement. Like in these areas. But then here. Should these also be smooth? Maybe this one? These ones? Sure. The, the outside patios and stuff? Yes. And I want these to look grey, so these need to be a different kind of grey though. Just I I don't care all that much what grey they are, it's just they need to be different so that they look a bit different. Um Maybe like this? Our beautiful AC units, you know? <laughs> Exquisite. <laughs> As for the building itself, I kind of think that these either okay. So I'm I'm of two minds here. So either I want these to be like a colorful portion, or I want these to be the colorful thing. I think I'm leaning towards the the top of the building being colorful. Maybe maybe a red. Ooh, maybe a blue. Again, white, white. Oh, maybe in this. This has that kind of like um vibe that says that I am modular. I don't know about like uh, how it is where where you live, but. When I uh, was in school, our school district was, um, for high school and otherwise, the school district was quite full. So they brought these like temporary units for extra, uh, the, the, for extra like space. Um, and I was in one of those for, for a year in school. And it had this kind of vibe. And I'm, I'm kind of channeling that. I don't know. Again, the the point for this building isn't to be, isn't to be gorgeous. It's to be functional. And while I I would like it to be, like passable to look at, I don't need it to be passable in the uh, beauty way. If that makes sense. Um, I would like it to be passable in the sense that it evokes inspirational play, maybe. And this, this is definitely bringing me somewhere. I don't, I don't know about you. <laughs> I am, I am being transported. Um. I also like this one. I mean, well. I don't like it, but I, I dislike it in a way that feels right. <laughs> is that is that is that reasonable? <laughs> uh, 
gosh. And what do I make the other parts? I just painted these in. But I only think this up, upper bit should be this color. Um. Hmm. Maybe like a darker gray to make it like proper depressing, you know? Oh well, that is, that is proper depressing. I need to divide this into parts too, so that's not just this, but I think this has to be this up to here. Oh, that's gonna be a pickle. Because that means, uh, to me, that means that all of this needs to be this, and I, I don't want that. Um, I wish I had this, but in like, with like gray racing, you know? What about this? It's got like a industrial brick feel. Oh, it will look good for the down bit. For this. Oh. Ooh. is not realistic at all <laughs> but I like that um, I do like that I don't like that maybe do I no <laughs> I don't like that it gave it a shot you know I want something suitably filthy. Aluminium. That's a bit too filthy. <laughs> but, you know, for this bit. <laughs> it's getting to be too many, like, textures. No? Yes? Maybe? You know, this is the reason why I build in an iterative way. Iterative way? I don't know how to pronounce that. So I usually, what I usually do is I make like a, a bare bones basic thing. And then I've decided I don't like this. Um, I've decided that, I decided like I'll, I'll add to it later. And then like eventually over time stuff becomes quite nice if I do say so myself this seems like a good first pass you know maybe one of those things that I need to mull over and think about okay then maybe a couple of plants somewhere apparently we are tropical sure or semi-tropical island it's very exotic for me as a Finnish person but you know if you got the tools, why not? We can't do uh, a Finnish environment anyway in this game, so can't can't really do that. Do I want like bushes here? No, not really. Again, I feel like it's industrial. Well, not industrial, but like it's an official location. Maybe it will have like turf, you know? Mm -hmm. 
Ah, oh, but that's a problem though. Do I want it? It has to go all over to the end. Yep. That's how it is. But not on this side, because then it won't blend well. I... I guess? Hmm. Let me get back to the insides. I'm just gonna paint everything with a neutral color first. Because then if I forget to paint something, uh, it'll just be neutral and that's fine. Can't be mad at neutral. Do I want this to be kind of filthy? <laughs> oh, I might want to. I'm so sorry, everyone, if you're a marine biologist or you upkeep essential infrastructure in a location like this. I am... I have immense um, respect to anyone who works in keeping things clean for other people in general but just oh I love it oh the jank it, there's something about it that calls to me what can I say it's not you it's me <laughs> I'm the problem <laughs> oh okay and here I'd like this to be centered, but the sims doesn't work like that, so... Unfortunately... I'm gonna have to deal. Hmm... Is this the same color as this? Could be... Just to add a bit of something here. Do they get a palm? To cover that weird, weird bit. Sure. You know? No. You can't even tell. <laughs> no, I think that kind of like just puts attention to it. What I could do to make it into like a feature is to... Oops. Is to literally put a stripe in there. I think I'd need to do that a couple of times, so that it's not, like, super weird. It is pretty weird. But again, that's a good idea for some other location to do, like, an accent wall for the front, maybe? Could be this corner. This corner could be accented. Oops. Do I like that? Again, yeah, I like the idea, not for this place. You know? This is why we test stuff, so let me know. Alright. I think... The next thing I think I want to do... Oh, I need to put some random floors in place, actually. Sorry, I was gonna, I was gonna do something else, but no, 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 no. I, I, in fact, need to do this first. <laughs> That's too fancy. Maybe. And then the upper floors, they get, like, a wood. <laughs> I don't know. Some wood. A generic wood. And then the bathrooms get... A tile. And the kitchen gets a tile also. Okay. Oh, give me the door. Thank you. Okay. Now we have kind of like the layout in place. I'm gonna save here again, just in case. And um, I'm gonna take a sip of my drink. Remember to hydrate, you too. Okay. Now what I'm gonna do is put in 
the essential furnishings. So these are the ones that are like what I consider to be core gameplay for this particular venue. So I'm going to start with... What am I going to start with? Hmm. I want there to be a little place where you can buy magazines. But do I want that to be a different venue? I do want that to be a different venue. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. This. I want this job board here. Uh, not because this is going to be here permanently. Um, this is going to be in the city hall eventually. But I want Sims to be able to come here and like choose a specific job, you know? And that's what that's for. Um, and then the other essential things that I want to have here. Some of the skill building items perhaps? Creativity wise, I don't think I want any of these here specifically. What these? We could have a motor here um, for a quote unquote submarine repair, you know? <laughs> We're not gonna have a submarine because um, that doesn't happen in the game, but you'd come by here and deal with your handiness skill, sure. Or your mechanical skill. Um, then bookshelves somewhere probably. Hmm. Exercise mats. Again, these are modded, but Sims can do like exercise on these. I'm gonna put those by the beach. Um, I don't really know what else to put here. Maybe like a. No, but I, maybe this is like a gym, you know? A little gym. Then this one also, sure, for fixing things. Sure. Oh, I'm getting a call. I'll be right back. Okay, where were we? Um, yes, we we're putting the essential items to the location. So I think those are all the um, all the things that I need here. I um, the other things that I want to add that are needed for every every lot, uh, as far as I'm concerned, is the toilets, for example. Um, I'm gonna put some here and this could be a toilet why not you know and maybe upstairs also yeah it probably also wants a door to this toilet <laughs> probably <laughs> you know who am I who am I to say if they don't but you know all right and then the sinks one only fits one sink but it's probably fine I, 
I'm starting to feel now that I'm not sure if I like this uh, mod that puts things in the different places. I just, um, I don't know. It feels weird. Maybe I'm just uh, one of those who well, well, I don't like change people, you know? That could, that could definitely be it. In fact, I do know that I am one of those people. <laughs> you know, that's one of the reasons I play The Sims and not some other game. <laughs> oh, good old routine. Oh, PRB? Okay, I, um... I have a washing machine on, so if you can hear some of those sounds, that is unfortunate. Um, hmm. Do I want mirrors here? I, I mean, I do, but I kind of don't want people to try to up their charisma here. Hmm. Okay. Anything else I'd like to add to the toilets? Yes, actually there is. And it's not here. <sighs> this will take a while for me to learn, I think. This. Should we have... Actually, no, not in common spaces, right? But what I do want to have here is shower in this space. I want there to be a shower and then I want to use one of my this this thing yep 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 and then I need a locker you know so you can put your stuff in here, change, whatever, do your thing. Yeah. Next thing I definitely want to have here is the kitchen. And this could be a better modern kitchen and pretty, like, no, not the fanciest. Like, I'm not gonna get... I could get the kitchen basic one, actually. I do love kitchen basic. Oh. I'm gonna double fridge it up, because this is uh, a venue. Mm -hmm. I wonder if normal sims can use this, or if they need a separate one. Do I want to make this kind of into a restaurant? I don't know. I mean, I guess it would make sense. I don't like that you'd have to be seated. But if I make it into a restaurant, that means that Sims are actually not cooking themselves, but they're like eating like normal people. Hmm. I think I'm gonna make it into a restaurant, but I am going to include a buffet table also. In case I want to use this as a venue for like events later. Yeah. Like I don't want it to be fancy, but... I want it to be pretty functional. So it's gonna be... The cafeteria tables. Maybe just like this. One more in the corner. I kind of don't want it to be by the... By that, though. What if... It's like this? No... Hmm. 
Again, this isn't meant for for a romantic getaway or anything like that. This is you work here. You eat in the cafeteria. Invisible? Eh. I've I've clearly done something I shouldn't have. Is that gonna be a roughly a match? Sure. I, I kind of like this warm orangey, but it's it's very nostalgic, you know? Because I did used to play this game as a kid as well. I can... I remember all of these details with warmth. Okay, so this is concrete. I could allow for some, some fa fanciness in here. This entire area, actually. I like it when sims get whimsical, so I think I should um, allow myself to get whimsical also a little bit. And then if I can get a paneling that's kind of like this orangey wood also. For this wall. Because then I could make these be... Which one was it? The same color also. And it would be a lot less jarring. Oh, this is a very cafeteria wood though. You know what? This is... <laughs> it's that cafeteria chic, you know? <laughs> oh, beautiful. And I don't know about you, right? What kind of... Uh, schools you went to or what kind of places you're you're eating your lunch in but um where I went to it was pretty common that the upper floor of of a building was like a different color it was just plain and then sometimes there were like paintings on top of there of like um, people that are relevant to said building Maybe that's what we're gonna do. You can imagine these are um, <laughs> not her. <laughs> we can remember. We can pretend these are like important people. Sure. And Gidri? Yeah. Why not? But but this version. Any of these, like, less... You know what? Uh, less ostentatious? No. Nope. None of those are. Alright, well... You know what, Ghidri? Live your best life. You know? A little bit of something something. These would probably be, like, lower down. In real life. But... Like, they need to be high up so that no one can, like, touch them too much, but they need to be low down enough to be able to see. And that's the, uh, That's always the, 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 the trade-off, kind of. You want things to look beautiful, but you want them to be functional, also. Hmm. Maybe the clean version of this. Where is it? This isn't it. Maybe this part is also clean. Yeah. Oh yeah, the ceilings. Mm. You know what? I'm fine the ceilings with the ceilings being white here. I don't I don't think I have any reason to paint the ceilings here. If I find out a reason later, I'll I'll do that, but it's 
it's mostly fine. Now, in these places, um, in the gym particularly, I'd like to have a lino of some kind. Or should this just be concrete? Uh, it should just be concrete. But I do want the walls to be a bit different. I want a little bit of a color pop in the walls. Just paint it is fine. Maybe we could have like a a bright little blue or something. Sure. And then here. Here I think we need some some desks. Like not or maybe it's just a counter on the wall. Hmm. You know what? That is probably actually what I want. I don't I don't want computers in here. I know it would be a, like a or maybe I do. Do I? Do I want a computer in here? No. I do not want a computer in there. Or a TV? <laughs> no. I think I might want a TV in here though. Because this could be like a waiting area. this and then like a magazine rack or something Rex would be somewhere in here, right? Probably here. <laughs> Microphone. Hmm. Maybe we need to have like a music record store some at some point. Oh, this. This definitely needs to be somewhere. piece I don't I don't get it a divider we can have a divider in here sure okay oh yeah and I got a lot of like different kind of boozy things what is excuse me oh, <laughs> oh I forget everything I had into one of these but also oh gosh I wish I could size up things like if oh, a gun <laughs> okay <laughs> already there. Okay. Hmm. 
Now this is for for mixing for a recording studio, but you know, maybe. Still on the hunt for the magazine rack. <laughs> Maybe it's just a like um like this, you know. And then uh, a classic IKEA bookcase. Now I just need a an end table to put these on. Can they go on this? Not really. I mean, they can, but it's not good. <laughs> what about... What about something like these? Yeah. Then I could have a little rug underneath both of these. And it would make for a nice and like cozy place to wait. That is not a little rug. But I do like this. It's not very... It's a bit too nice, I think, though. This would be a good size. But not, not the correct pattern. These are the... this way. But white for a... For a venue? No. What about just this? You know, just to frame stuff in a little bit. And I can bring these back, I think. Or here, maybe? Make it a little bit less depressing to be around here. Just not not only grey. This entire upper floor could be this. Yeah? Yeah? I think the downstairs is mostly done. There's some stuff I still want to put in here. Um, kind of want to add stuff to the tables a little bit. You know, so that if I take screenshots in here, it's not going to look as, as bare. A uh, food vendor? Oh, this would be a great place for these. Oh, for maybe one. Maybe just one. <laughs> and I'll need to find out the, the cheat to make him... Not snap, sorry. Excuse me. I need to look it up. Because I... I don't have a good memory. Let's see. My cheat sheet. Um, oh, quarter tile placement would probably do fine here. And control F to enable it. Yeah, yeah. And this entire thing is made of this. So should this bit actually, if that's... that's. Hmm. Let 
Is that functional, you think? I'm not sure. Cigarettes? Do we want to be able to buy cigarettes in here? Uh, we could. Could be on the other side. Seems healthy. <laughs> it's great. Um... No, we want people to buy phones in here. What else? A razor? Uh, a phone? I will want phones upstairs. No, I think I'm gonna do the offices next. So the offices are going to be all almost the same. I want there to be a little bit of difference between them, so I'm gonna give them a slightly different wallpapers or like I'm gonna paint them slightly differently. This isn't like super realistic, it's just um, something that makes it a bit more interesting to look at. In my opinion, when uh, when playing, I am gonna favor this style though, actually, so that they have the same baseboards at least. All right, <laughs> they are all going to have the same desk, different chairs though. I tend to find that even though like companies supply your desks, they don't always like you sometimes get. Uh, the ability to buy your own chair. So maybe one of these has a, like a, a different chair. Who knows? Maybe this is like the, the, the default chair. And then this one has a different one? No, the default chair would be something like this, right? And then one person can have a a differing chair. Gosh. I am tempted to use these. I need to make a cat cafe just for to use all of those items. Maybe they have like a a gamer chair, you know? <laughs> a little bit. And then all of them will have computers. And I want them to be the, the worst computers, specifically. Um, because I want to encourage my sims actually buying their own computers. Eh. There. Oh, so nostalgic. <laughs> and then all of them will need a place for uh, a visitor to sit. So I'm gonna give them one of these. And all of them will get one personal item. Whatever that happens to be, I guess. So for, for this one, it's... It's gonna be a bush. Nice. For this one, it's going to be... What is this? An award for excellence. Yep, sure. Put that on the wall. For this one... A mirror. And... What do you want? A bottle. <laughs> they only kind of have this one though. So maybe they don't... Maybe they don't need that one. They have a whale. Nice. And then I'm gonna copy these over. Because I want there to be another kind of sitting area up here. It's gonna have the exact same... Same stuff. Um, you can kind of wait here for 
for your turn to visit the offices. And then... A couple of, like, movable chairs outside here. Maybe a chessboard? Why not? Could do with a chessboard. I don't think I'm gonna include that in many Sims homes, so... And then lighting, of course. <laughs> Lamps. The... My nemesis. Um, I think I'm going to include these. I'm personally not a big fan of these, most of the time. But I think they fit the vibe, you know? This is the right place for them. So... I can't really not put them. But the bathrooms are gonna have these, because they're... I want to be able to see, also. And these cover very little. Oh, I need to finish the kitchen. Hmm. The gym will also have these. I really favor these so much. because <laughs> Just let me make stuff without getting it all weird. There would be lamps over here, so I'm gonna use more objects. And then here, maybe slightly, slightly fancier ceiling lights. And by slightly, I really do mean very slightly. We may be part funded by um, by SimCity, but we're not we're not that posh. And here. Same. How many square? That's three. One, two, three. And then I'm gonna need to put also wall lights because the light doesn't quite transfer in the Sims like I would like it to. Maybe these? Yeah, I think that'll do. One here, directly on this. Sure. Oh, I could have these over- oh, yes. Yes. Oh, that is not working. Okay, well. We have space for a self-painted thing here in the future, maybe. If one of um, our sims gets into painting, there's a spot. And then this area. Hmm. The indoors are pretty lit, not the outdoors. Well, I want there to be some lights here, for sure, and I want this to be visible, so probably lights here. Maybe like this? And then do I need to put some in these? No. But one would be nice here. Could just be on the floor. Someone's brought a lamp in there.
Yeah, that's not bad. Again, for the first pass, we're gonna add stuff as we figure out we need it. I quite like it. It it's it come along it's coming along and it's much better than I expected it to be. So that's a that's a win in my book. Um something that I still think I could do is change these the floors. But I'm not sure what to, so I'm going to let that simmer. And when we update this place, we might do that at the same time. But yeah, um... Turns out that that is going to be a long ass video already, so... <laughs> I'm gonna stop here, and... We'll, we'll do more next time. Um, hopefully we'll start at the apartments next time. Um... I have been Yenny, you have been you, and we have been doing things. Um. Bye! <laughs>